Traditionally, summer starts in December and runs to the end of February, but the seasons aren't what they used to be, according to new research. Hot temperatures are starting earlier and finishing later, blowing up the summer season across every capital city by up to a month. Summer should be over, but at 36 degrees on the coast in Sydney, this lot wouldn't know it. It still feels a bit summery to me. It feels like the middle of summer. If it feels like summer is getting longer, that's because it is. Researchers from the Australia Institute say the season is starting sooner and finishing later, compared to seasons in the 1950s and 60s. We use that as sort of a benchmark traditional summer, and then we looked at when those average temperatures occurred in the last 20 years. And what we found is, according to what summer used to be, it's starting much earlier than December. Sydney has an extra month of beach weather, but around two weeks less winter chill. Melbourne summers are now more than five weeks longer, losing almost three weeks of winter. There's an extra five weeks and one day of summer in Adelaide, which shaved off 10 days from winter. Brisbane has 11 more summer days, losing a calendar month from the cooler season. With Perth adding 35 days to their hot season and losing 25 of cold. Nice for some, but hot weather has its own risk. Uh, along with an extended fire season, along with the health impacts, extreme heat and heat waves are the largest killer of all natural hazards. Today is a rare calm moment for rural firefighters. Most of them have been working non-stop since August last year. And as summer gets longer, so too will the fire season, which means these calm moments will be few and far between. Consider not just the fire season, but obviously those opportunities also uh, where tradition would get things like hazard reduction done during the off season. So it, it's limiting those opportunities. Adapting to these challenges will be no day at the beach.